Welcome back to Sportsbook Review Videos. It is a short-slated Thursday night of NBA action. Only three games on tap for you this evening. However, in order to make a little bit more value out of those three games, I have chosen the first two of them to parlay together. Hopefully give you a little bit more value after we won one and push a pick last night. We'll start off our first leg of the parlay here with the Sacramento Kings. Coming off the back-to-back, -back, head down to Miami to play the Heat tonight. Heat come in as an eight-point favorite in this one with a total of right at 200 points. Now, the Kings, of course, played last night in Atlanta, lost to the Hawks, to Marcus Cousins, elbowed a guy, and the rest are no one really even noticed. So tonight, going to be interesting to see how they respond coming off of the back-to-back, -back. and despite the fact that they are 2-1 and one against the spread so far on back-to-back -back games this season, the second half of those back-to-backs, I think the Heat, actually have a really good chance of not only covering this game, but winning big against a Sacramento Kings team that obviously has their issues at times. With uh, the Heat as one of the best defensive teams in the NBA, giving up only 91 points per game, and with Goran Dragic finally looking like the Dragic of old, this team has five-plus defenders in their starting lineup. They play really hard. They play at a very slow pace, which I think is going to bother Sacramento. And right now, Sacramento's the worst defensive team in the NBA, giving up about 107 to 108 points per game. Look for the Heat and uh, Hassan Whiteside to slow down Boogie Cousins, and if they can do that, I think the Heat cover and win this one very, very easily. Add Heat minus 8 to the first leg of your parlay. Now, coming up next is the Milwaukee Bucks heading into Cleveland tonight to play the Cavaliers. The Cavs come in as a huge 9.5-point favorite in this one, total of about 194 points. Now, as long as all systems are go for the Milwaukee Bucks tonight and all their guys are healthy, uh, Jabari Parker being the most pertinent, I think, because he has said that he might be able to come back tonight, I think the Bucks once again have the ability to cover here against the Cleveland Cavaliers. The Cavs have actually lost their last five games against the Spread. One of those games against those aforementioned Milwaukee Bucks just a few nights ago, where the Bucks won 108 105. And uh, Miami also, uh, just or excuse me, Cleveland also has really just uh, not looked great so far here uh, over their last couple of games. Lost a very winnable game to the Detroit Pistons, where they gave up a lead as well. With Giannis Antetokounmpo having to guard LeBron James tonight, if he can do anything uh, other than uh, let, let LeBron go off for as many points as he wants tonight, I think the Bucks actually have a very, very good chance of covering 9.5 here. I know Milwaukee didn't look great against the Washington Wizards, but that was more so, I think, the Wizards finally figuring out that they need to play small. The Bucks, I think, will also play small tonight here, potentially. And with Greg Monroe in the lineup here, I don't think that the uh, Cavs have enough firepower to win this game in double figures. I think Cavs hold them uh, hold the loss to single digits and cover the plus nine and a half. So that is your NBA parlay. Go Heat minus eight bucks plus nine and a half. Best of luck to you on that one. Make sure you check out my play tonight on the marquee matchup of the night as well between the Clippers and the Warriors. But until then, for Sportsbook Review, I'm Jordan Sharp.